play, 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 play. Morning guys, it's 28th of January, take two. We're going back to the same place today to have a look at maybe two or three lorries. Maybe buy one, maybe not. Let's see how we're gonna. Welcome to my channel. I hope you already subscribed. Thanks for bringing back. Yeah, no problem. Apologies for the delay. Right, so it was a, a yellow Volvo you said, was it? Yeah, mate, 62 plate, yeah. Is it still there? Is it DU62 LNW? That's it, mate, yeah. Yeah, it's still there, yeah. You know the mileage on it, do you? The neck of the woods again. Yeah, Oxfordshire. We came down a couple of days ago, me and my missus did look at that red FH. Oh yeah, I remember you, I yeah. remember you. Uh, the, the white one looks nice, the white one looks nice as well. Uh, yeah, I see that, that 60. 63 plate, yeah. Yeah, yeah, uh, after you left, I, I just better, you know, quickly around it to be fair. Uh, Mind the mileage is low on this one, 495 the mileage is. Oh really, 495? All right, mate, sound, yeah. sound. Well, I'm coming down today, mate, I'll be, uh, I'll be a couple of hours and I'll come and have a look at it. Yeah, no problem. Listen, I, you, well, you know the script. I'll give you the keys. I'll leave you to it. Yeah, no, I love the job. Thank <laughs> you, mate. If you want to look at our white one at the same time, then I'll, I'll just grab them both for you. I probably will do, mate, to be fair. I will. I'll have a look at both of them, yeah. It does look pretty clean, if I'm honest with you. But, I mean, obviously, you're, 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 you're feeling the skin back, aren't you, sir? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> as, you, as you should. As you should. Yeah. All right, mate. I'll no. see you in a bit. Okay, no worries. Cheers, mate. Ta-da. Take care. Bye-bye. Oh, nice. loads of time to, uh, to make mate. it perfect yeah. <laughs> as you said make it perfect I'm gonna make sure it right mm -hmm. as soon as we can and then, then we can take it out for a spin and every keep it warm keep it warm too taking we can't drive with fire and water but we could we could we could give somebody a lift somewhere yeah so <laughs> we can go see more in here oh, yeah. just for the crack <laughs> Just to see more. Oh, I. Oh, I was going to get us a thingy. A coffee. A coffee. Yeah, next time. I do, I prefer driving fast. I just know what it's doing. To the engine wear and tear. I don't, but I can imagine. I told you enough times. <laughs> enough times plus one. Well, I can assure you now. When you buy me a lorry and you get up to scratch, I will be dead nice to it. I will drive it nice. I will not brag it. I'll open it up a little bit on the motorway. 56. <laughs> okay. okay. But I'll be very, very nice to it. So you don't have to fix it more than you need to. The golden lights. Yeah. Too many, too many. It's like maintenance. The it screams maintenance to you. It does. To me, it 
it's like, okay. <laughs> when a lorry's overtaking like this here, if it takes him a long time to overtake, you should slow down on the left. Do you slow down and let him pass? What you're gonna do is knock him back a little notch, let him speed up a bit, or you literally will you sit there for 10 miles straight and let him overtake? Not 10 miles straight, but it depends on the situation. If I am running out my driving hours and I know that if I've got just, just enough time to get to somewhere to park where I'm going to, yeah. for my break or something, and I'm literally like really tight on driving hours, then I might just sit there, but not for ages and ages and ages. Um, but also, If I'm on the motorway, I do not slow down because there's three lanes. Lorries are not allowed in the past then, so all the cars can go around anyway. I'm not slowing anybody down so he can do whatever he wants and he thinks he can overtake me. Uh, but obviously, if it's a dual carriageway, I'm not in a rush, I know where I'm going. Yes, I will not go down much. But not always. Because if I'm desperate to get somewhere without stopping somewhere else fast, Get that excited. 
five minutes. We'll be there. Half eleven. Yeah, half
don't forget these um, stupid traffic lights. Yeah, I worry not. Stay in the right and lane now. Yeah. Hope they work today. Because that was a ball like. Even the lorries were getting frustrated and beeping. Yes. Crikey, me bikey. Right, we're back again. Let's see what we can find. Scania? I think that I think those Scanias have not got a flat floor. Is that the yellow one we're looking for? Oh no, that's a dot. Mate, I've got a truck. I spoke to someone this morning on the phone about a 62 plate yellow FH. Yeah, what a registration number. I've got quite a few. Yeah. What a yellow FH is? There's only one on the website. Two seconds. Let's look at them all. Is it looking? Good. Yeah? Mileage is really low, 715. Close door. Cool. What are we doing with the laptop? Oh, it's on there. That's worth more than this truck. The horn doesn't work. Oh. That's neither here nor there, that'd be a broken wire. At least the windows work. Oh, that good. works in manual, even though the covers are missing, but we can live with it. Yes, it's smoky. It's due taco calibration in July. Very smoky. It is rather smoky, I agree with that. Let's see what happens. New indicator stalk. Mm -hmm. We'll just see what happens when it clears. It's a. It might just be because it's cold. That's broken. That's not here, there. We don't care, do we? Yeah. Okay. Hi, Wednesday. You have got Bluetooth, but it's not very good. That's okay. Keep an eye on that light. Mm -hmm. The one's good. Load of cliff plate. And How much do you want for it if it's okay? If it's got test babe, it's worth it. Alright, he's got MOT, has it? Just check it now. This one's got a full 12 months test. Nice. How's it, how it gone through a test? <laughs> All doesn't work. Yeah. That's an MOT, that's a failure. failure. Tuck is a little bit worn. The red lights come on. You've got little night lights there, you see. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's working. Sound. This one never works in there. Hold up. Normally, that's where your microwave would go. Uh huh. Oh, well, let's look at the fridges and that. Oh, yeah. Look at that. It's your night light now. That. You'll want that closed at night time, but that's broken. But that's neither in there, is it, to be fair? Uh, fridges. Oh, hey. fridge. That's better. Cold? Doesn't might not work. be. Hmm? Doesn't work. You can fix that. Well, it might be the fridge itself, but we'll have a look at it. Might just be a fuse. Mm. Anyway, it's got a 
there's just no power to it at all. It's a single bunk, which is a bonus. Mm -hmm. Some bottles. Of, you got storage there. When you back up there, or when the seats forward, yeah. this comes up, Stars and you have a bit more storage. Work. <laughs> Do you have a go? Yeah. Oh my word, I've got 
armrest and everything. Right, into gear, but close. Oh my god, it's so much better than the red one. Do you want me to go back in? It's up to you, go down to the end and turn around if you want. It's a little bit tight to turn around there, but do it. No, I'll go to. in, it's too tight. <laughs> nice. Oh yeah, much better. Much nicer. Unless to fix, yeah? Yeah, no. Nothing to fix, apart from the horn and set from wheels. Come on for the steering. We're you want me to change this? I'll put a new one of these in. It's broken. Well, I never have it on me. I normally have it on my feet anyway, so I'm bothered. If you're not bothered, I'm not bothered. Oh, I like, I like it. I'm a bit too close. <laughs> Don't need an armrest. I use it on the motorway, but not in here. Mini truck, you like it? I do like it. Careful, this rebar sticking out the ground. You're going to miss it anyway, but keep over to the left a little bit. You mean that? Um... That's it. Once you start going, just go as you get stuck. Go. Oh God. Go, 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 go. But he's going over the rebar. It's like a curb anyway, so I wouldn't have gone on it. Where does it go? In between the two scanners, a rose between two thorns. <laughs> nice, brakes are good. Just put your um, arm. Uh -huh. Thanks. Love it. Let's get a look at the 63. What this one failed? I'm sure I looked at this one. Um, what it failed on previous MOTs. So it failed on steering, spray suppression, aim of headlight, brakes and components. Nothing major. So it's had a few problems with its brakes in the past. Mm. But apart from it's nothing to handle. British makes. Mattress is a bit nicer, yeah, but I'll one. get a new one in your so. This one's a year old, it's only got six months MOT. Is it cheaper? 16 this one is. Oh, so this one's cheaper, definitely. 18, this one's two grand cheaper. Six months MOT. Oh, that's because it is... Um, Same sort of mild. <laughs> This one's what two uh, two years older. One year older. One year older. Two grand cheaper. Two grand cheaper. But you don't and like the colour. Six months MOT. The other one's got twelve months. Oh right. And the, the other one's got less mileage and it's newer. Okay. So the other one's better, really. But this one's cheaper, but better. But cheaper, but better. Yeah, I see what you mean. Yeah, I think I prefer the white one. Let's see what how it drives. As well. Oh, rockety. You're on the back with yeah?
Ready? Did you want to try this one as well? No, yeah. Just yeah. in case. You just don't like it, though? No, I don't, I don't mind it. No, I just, uh, it sounds okay. When we get out. Engines breathing on slowly. They want to inject sleep. Wow, was this one behind the light? There. In fact, I'd turn around and go in that space there because you can get a bit of, bit of a swing. You should do it. Feel me too? Yeah. Well, so far we looked at two trucks within one hour. Probably because there's less wrong on them, isn't it? Yeah. Last time we were there for, for age. Before we're going, no, yeah, I'm yeah. right. Well, what, 63? Yep, I'm looking at the one for you. We're gonna go another chat. Yep, you had your laptop on them, yeah. I have a little trash. That's good. Does it tell you? I welcome it. A lot of people get offended with that. Yeah, it's far better. Yeah, you know, you know what you're checking, isn't it? Yeah, we did a little bit. I looked through the test for a full year, and it's yeah, tax and go. It is, yeah, it's not full. The injects seem to go around, the engine breathing slightly. Yeah. Do it. Yep. I'm proud of that. Oh my god, we're going, Larry. Congratulations. <laughs> Thanks. What's the score with this now? Is it bank transfer? Bank transfer. Yeah. No problem at all. We just bought a lorry. Oh my god, we just Why bought a lorry. We he? just got a lorry. We, uh, we just, we've got a bar, we got a lorry. A white one, 63 plate. I have a lorry. I'm gonna go working soon. Not much to fix on it, is it? No. I can go work in it tomorrow if I wanted to. Let's try and pay for this now. If we were ready. Yeah, normally if it doesn't let you pay the whole thing, you just, it'll do by one. You don't have to wait for like next day. Oh really? You can do it like seven grand, then another seven grand, all like within minutes. Did that before. Can't remember what for. We just bought a lorry. We did. Give me a kiss. <laughs> you didn't seem that exciting though, is that because you had to be all like manly? Well, I was trying to be, but... Sorry, we... sorry. <laughs> I was trying to be ish, but so exciting. So ex oh my God. On our second try as well, that's fast. We work fast, Michael. So... Right, so I've tried the whole lot. Try the whole lot first, yeah, see what happens. <laughs> And then we can pick it up next week. Jobs are good and jobs are good and my signs, Lena Trucker, will look good on the white. I mean, it would have looked good on the red or yellow, but look the best on the white. Oh my god, I can't believe it! I can't believe it. Did it? Yeah, new custom on my bottom. Maybe they know you. Do you want to tell them? What if it's in the wrong bank? It's not. It, it, <laughs> yeah, it so, tells you yeah. that the details are correct. You don't need to tell them anything? It just fell Why has it not come up as gone? I don't know. You sent something in there. Oh, maybe um, their bank has to approve it. Or something. Is it? Right. <laughs> they, they just email the. Oh, yeah. Nice. That's good. Gosh. I 
back in the day you've been in the office filling up a form with your bank details waiting for a week for it to clear Sold the scene Are you got the keys or anything? Is that all we got to prove our money's gone? Yeah, that's a good deal of logbook actually Yeah We'll be back next week No, but please talk to them but Like we gave them like loads of money I know we'll get a piece of paper Yeah, it's not, it's not exactly a little backstreet business is it? What if they move by next week somewhere? <laughs> No, doubt that place is massive. <sighs> okay, okay. Let's go and uh, calm ourselves down. Where is it? Yeah, where is it? It's around here. No, it's there. It's not. Sure. Oh yeah, because we have to go. Yeah, it's, it's between those, between those two scanners, somewhere. Look, there, 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 there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> huh? There it is. There it is. Uh, very, very far. Oh, MGs. I just got a lorry. A whole new lorry. I just, do you know what goes around in my head? I'm just, all I'm thinking for, oh, it's good to get back here now. Tell me what you're thinking. I is literally the, don't is know. Is the day. They agreed too fast. Yeah, now this is what I'm, hold on a second. Too fast. We paid for it fast. All we got a piece of paper. I know what you're saying. No, it's the it's right. So before they were trying to flog a really C63 plate with more miles on the clock. With the same sort of money. And he, he wouldn't drop anywhere below 16, right? Mm. Now we've we've you know okay, we this one's got a hundred thousand miles less on the clock. Mm. Uh, Newer, 63, same age. It's the same age. It doesn't want anything doing to it because it's just had an MOT. Apart mm. from the horn doesn't work. That's that's a broken milestone. Um, I'm just, I'm just black white. Do you, you know what I'm thinking? Hold on. I think, I'm, I'm like, it's just shooting in the dark. But I think they've got like a target to sell them for 60, 15 or 16 grand or something m at most. And if they don't sell, they ship them off. Yeah. I think that's what it is. They can't sell it for like 16. And obviously wherever the profit on top is theirs, so maybe to keep or some sort of bonus they get out of that. I think that's what it is, because he was very willing to sell it as soon as. That's why I was thinking we should have said like three grand less, two grand less. Yeah. And then he'd be like, no mate, three grand, we can't do that. Well, what's the best you can do? And then he comes out with the best he can do, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Next time we're buying a lorry, that's what we're doing. But at least you got, you know, you tried to get some money down rather than not. I was surprised. I thought he'd just come straight back. He didn't even try and get me up. That's yeah, the thing, so, did he? Yeah, nice, nice. He he could have he could have tried and put two or three hundred, four hundred quid on top of that. Yeah. To be fair, if you did go lower, he probably we, we still would have probably ended up anyway. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. With a little bit of haggling and whatever else, it would make feel us better because we're thinking, okay, this is the best we could have done. He obviously thought, well, this is the best, you know, it's the good price for that lorry, so. Yeah. But just to push our luck, we should always go way lower than we think. It's done though now. We bought a lorry. We bought a lorry. Oh <laughs> my god! A lorry. I'm happy with that lorry. I'm as very well. excited with that lorry. It's as a really well. good truck. And because you're so happy, it makes me ecstatic. We, we'll easily get, we'll easily get another four or five hundred thousand clicks out of that truck. Which is like a year's worth too. Four or five years. Yeah, we'll do one hundred in a year. It's obviously got wear marks. The steering wheel's worn out, isn't it? I put like a cover on it. Put a cover on it. I go on Amazon and I'll get like one of those leathery ones. Yeah. Leathery something. Um, the fridge doesn't work, we should have to do something with the fridge. If you can wire it, wire it. If not, I've got two portable ones I can but put it in. Done. The night each seemed to work for a little bit and switched off. I don't know if that's because the thermostat clicked it out. I'm not sure. Gosh, I have a lorry, I have a lorry. Thanks, babe. Oh my god. OMG. Oh, um, really good lorry. I just, I'm, really I'm baffled. Good. I'm just baffled. I don't know whether he thinks he's won me over because I've come in too much, or I'm just like, I, I, or he's not very good at hunting because we just. He could have asked for more, and we probably would have paid it all. But with a with a full twelve months test on it. Full 12 months test, yeah. and nothing really wrong with it. Oh, I want to get rid of them super singles in the front. I hate super singles. It just puts Different pressure on the steering wheel. Tires, yeah. yeah, smaller. Smaller tires. But 
big tires are good there, right? The tires are good. Why do you want smaller tires instead of bigger tires? Because the big tires put pressure on the steering wheel and change it pumps and steering boxes all the time. Oh. We just we just don't need that. We're just getting rid of it. The wiring harness hasn't been opened up yet, but it's a good thing or a bad thing, but no one's really messed around with the wiring. So the absolute wiring is solid. It's probably good because there was no problems with it, so they didn't open yeah. it. Yeah. It, it will have problems, don't get yeah, me wrong, yeah. it will. I'm it's gonna have blurry. to do this, the inject sleeves on it before it goes anywhere. I'm gonna do the inject sleeves. <laughs> Or at least take the injectors out and have a look. Oh, MGs, I'm gonna be driving it soon. All over the country. You what? Maybe abroad. Not that old. Not that one. Uh, oh, you were Next year, I'll take yeah. it over. I'll take a new one abroad. Should oh, go, MGs. Should we get the porridge pop somewhere to eat? Yeah, let's go and uh, entertain the idea. We'll have it fast. Make sure it doesn't blow itself up on the way. I can drive with you, yeah? yeah? I'll follow you. You follow me, I follow you. I'll follow you. We'll show the van. Okay, just in case just in case. Case. Just, 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 just. And I can drive and you can you can follow me. Okay. We're gonna have to say, I'll bring some diesel in the can, we'll put some diesel in. Yeah. Because we're gonna have to it's go very off and find somewhere. Two, two. And I'm still nervous. Because I've never ever had a truck for myself. No, me, that's ever. my first truck. I thought looking at trucks was, was nerve wracking, but now it's like having a truck is also nerve wracking, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Our first ever truck. I hope it doesn't blow up on the way home. Soon, soon. We have a van just in case. You said yeah. you checked, you looked. The tyres were good on it. The back tyres were one doing soon. You were happy to pay full price. Yeah, it's just on a test bay, but uh, and you know, it's it's good for the next year, you know, whole year of my teeth. We have our own truck. He looks at me, <laughs> <laughs> and you probably don't. Just have a little look on that on that website then, Forest. It looks good. It looks new. It looks clean. It does. It looks nice. The steps were all good, they weren't wobbling or anything. No. Inside was good, it wasn't as slimy as the other trucks, which was nice. No, we'll get rid of that slime. Yeah. Let's just, let's just spit the spray on it. Yeah, I do not so like it. spray. I do not like that spray. Don't ever buy it for me. No. We don't have to pay for it to be parked. We're so crazy. We're so crazy. We're such crazy people. No. We don't have to pay for it to be parked now. Fact, that's a good thing actually because we, we it's not going to be at the yard until the beginning First, of February. We can pay yeah. for yeah. Perfect timing. So we've got months to not really needing to fix anything with it. No, we'll just, we'll just run it and be ready. Be ready to go. to go. I was thinking the red one, it's only a grand off. And I was thinking, well, you know, it's, you know. It's only a grand extra if we would have got it and you know we've got a month to fix it and do everything but I'm glad now I'm really glad we didn't buy it because now we've got a better deal, better lorry. It is a good lorry though. Yeah. Because if that was me I probably would have got the red one. Not knowing much. I'm glad I'm, I'm glad that one grand and you stuck your teeth in it, you know, that was that was a good call. The front, the front bonnet, the struts are worn. The front bonnet doesn't hang at all though. Yeah. All the pick about is have I missed something? On the truck? Have I missed something? But I can't, it's just had an MOT. It can't be that bad. But the horn don't work, so... Yeah, how does it pass? Do you think they've watched the MOT up or something? No, you can't yeah. with the HTV. You physically can't do that. But there's, there's a broken wire somewhere on the way back from the test or something like that. Yeah, it won't be something major, will it? No, no. There was no fault in the dash. There wasn't the air dryer. The air dryer's got a fault. But the air dryer and the wall both share the same earth. I'm sure they do. Remember your computer, right? Yes, the computer. Yeah. It's got the usual uh, absolute easy house faults, but they don't come up on the dash. It's had a reprogram the Volvo that is. They got rid of them. Volvo. The engine doesn't seem to be leaking. There's a slight oil leak on the back. It doesn't look like the time in case still is leaking yet I'm sure it will but I can sort that out let's have a look at this plug for a bit go yeah 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 um, and we've not done 
yeah, the air dryer and the horn, which will use the same earth, so it'll be a joint wire and ring. Like it's with no fault in the dash at all. As soon as we get it, I'll drop the oil chain, change the oil straight away on it. Yeah, yeah, no, I'm just checking. I was only kidding. Oh, cool. <laughs> oh my gosh. I have a lorry. I have a lorry to drive, you have a lorry to fix. Yeah, so we bought a lorry. I've got a lorry. So, welcome to the Little Trucker channel. Subscribe. So, Cheers. Cheers. To our new lorry. To our new, to our new lorry. Cheers. <laughs> so, we bought a new lorry. Subscribe. The travels are yet to come. It might blow up on the way back home. It won't. It might, but it won't. I hope not. Let's hope it doesn't throw a valve on the way home or anything like that. Um, it's a good truck. It's white. The chassis is solid. It's Volvo. The H. engine is good. It's a Volvo F8, 13 litre with 460 horsepower. It's exactly what it is. It would have been nice to have 500 horsepower, but hey ho. It's very clean. Mm. I was surprised at how clean it is, actually. None of the wiring harnesses have been touched that's a good thing or a bad thing because it might be a broken wire in the waiting but it's not one in the past so it's okay at the minute bonus so far so good the brakes and the brake discs are as you might imagine worn but not that bad worn it's just passing the MOT yeah the sump isn't cracked the what the sump isn't cracked the sump I think also at the bottom of the engine is quite bad on the Volvo, they, they plastic. And they the red crap. one was cracked. It was. That's um, how I identify my lorries, a red and the white and the white. yellow. And you go with FH6 and FH5 and the HA, HF, FH13. Yeah. The night eater works. Yes. <laughs> there is a warning on the dash for the air dryer, but it's quite common on a Volvo. And the a small horn and the big horn, it hasn't got a horn at all. But so we'll should we deal with that. We'll fix it. The front bonnet, the gas struts are worn, so the front bonnet doesn't hold itself up. Oh yeah, I remember that. I had to hold it. You had to hold it, but we get some gas struts for that. That's no issue. Fifth wheel's quite new. So I recently had a fifth wheel at some point. Um, tires are okay. It's got super singles on the front. I don't like super singles on the front. It makes the steering heavy. And they just don't need it, so we're going to rip them wheels off and we're going to put some 295 80s on the front, which will make the steering a bit lighter, but less pressure on the steering box and the steering pump. Look, it's got a silly yellow stripe down the side of it. Yeah, but then the company. It's coming straight off. Straight off. Being the trucker goes straight on. You got some um, stickers. It's up. getting stickered up straight away, so the other truck stuff on it. So it's kind of... Greasy inside where they spray silicone spray trying I to make it nice. That, I find that tipper drivers do that as well, like day to day, just spraying it with some slime. Yeah, it just makes it's silicone. You, it, yeah, it but just, aren't you scared falling out your cab when you're in and out of it? But actually, it does say on the tin, do not spray steering wheel. Because oh. it's, or spray your step or your, your the, pedals. The, the, the arm things, the, the rails are definitely sprayed on them. I bet they spray because of the tarmac. So the time I couldn't stick on it or something. No, this spray because it just looks shiny and nice. <laughs> well, it's just dangerous. To me, it screams danger, danger, high voltage. I feel like we've done really well actually there. I was really quite surprised at 63. But I've seen it on the on the website and the website was like, you know, just it just looked good. And the mileage is great on it. You know, in 2013, I mean, this thing's seven, eight years old. It's done 715,000 clicks, which, you know, it's only normal person. Yeah, it's done loads of miles, but it ain't. It ain't done lots of miles. Engine breathes slightly. The end, the breather pipe that goes into the rock cover has cracked, and so you can see it breathing slightly. And the coolant in the radiator is just pure water, which means aircon that... Aircon works, right? The aircon works. Oh, we never checked the aircon, but the miles for the aircon. Which normally means that the injector sleeves are on the way out. Which is quite a common fault on the Volvo. You want to ch change them anyway, straight? Yeah, regardless of what happens, we're going to put new injector sleeves in it. Um, the injector yokes snap on them sometimes. We'll have to put them in the injector yokes. 
prop shots good, prop shots sound. So the brake discs are boom, but there's brakes in it. You pick up a set, do you pick up a disc for, is it 80 quid a disc? It's nothing really. I know the gentle on the new ones. I won't yeah. trash it. Power's reasonable, so we've got 460 horses, as you might have, you know, 500 horses is better, but it's our first truck. Best truck ever. Bobs are all nice in it, they all sound. The steering must be alright, it's just past an MOT. Uh, it did fail first time around on We didn't do the shaking something. test. I don't know, but it's just past that. I'm, I, That's I'm right. just so confident, you've just done an MOT, they've, they've done that on test. It might be worn, don't get me wrong, it might be worn. But it wouldn't pass, it was But it, it, it was, was that horrible, bad, it yeah. pass. The thing is, if you're buying a car, you can get away with a dodgy MOT on it. But on HTV, it is only done by a DVSA inspector, so you can't hide nothing because he's, he's, he's impartial, isn't he, to the place you're getting done. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really looking forward to going out on my first drive in it. In fact, that will be when we're picking it up, like. But then I'm looking forward to picking up the trailer, obviously. Yeah, you'll be setting off in the yard. And then I'm looking forward to my first ever job in it. Can you believe it? Did it have wheelnut tags? It didn't, did it? You can get some wheelnut tags no. for it. It didn't. Definitely found it. I mean, I'm, I'm just thinking about it now. I'm very excited. I can't, like, I, it's only just starting to sink in a little bit because for real life, we have a lorry that I am going to drive, which is mine. You know, if my wife is just after two months, I have to wait for the interim license to come in. Oh, that is what it is. But the point is, no matter what, we've got it. And no matter what, I think I'm going to drive it. At least from this place to Dickhart. Let's see how it gets on. If it's making us money, amazing. If it's not making us money, we'll flog it in like half a year. We can get a private plate now. But it should make money. Yeah. Yeah, get that chalker. Chalker. It's like, it's exciting and it's amazing and it's never, but like, it's like sinking in. It's like sinking in. <laughs> it's still. It's like first step, second step, there's still so much to do. All license, get we, jobs, oh, we're gonna, we're gonna get some, We're going to tax it now. Tax it, MOD it, insure it. We're going to, we're to we tax it on, on the logbook, don't I? Yeah, yeah. OMGs. Yeah, how well are you? Now we're coming back. Mm. Well, I've been working on these things for so many years, and you hear the engine start up, and you listen to these faults that go on with the engine. And I always think to myself, I wonder what that is, but it's so alright, I've got to pay for it. Mm. So if it's now I wonder what it is, now you have to pay for it, now you have to fix it, now you have to really think about it. Looking at these bollers, there's nothing new at all. I've looked at a million of these engines, fixed a million of these things. Now it's your own, it's your own engine in there. It's your own window buttons in there. It's your own... The only thing that's not your own is a um, mattress. I'm going to chug that thing. <laughs> yeah. It's your own little lights on there. Yeah. You know on the, on the front? In front of the windscreen? Because there's more thingies as well. Obviously that comes off. Straight off. <laughs> sure it's paid. We've got taxes. And we're going to feel it for three weeks. So. By the time we start getting paid, there should be around. Let's say... Should I have a voice? That's what I'm trying to work on. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, physically we can. But mm, I think let's just see. Or we can go and try for a newer, like a new lorry. I don't know. See what money's coming in. No, because it doesn't matter on finance, does it? Mm, well, we ain't getting new lot. Like, if we haven't fired, so we're not getting a new one until 2023. So what we'll do is we'll just hang on. We'll get out of that level. So glad we never had kids every day. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's really cute. But that means that means nothing. Staying at home. Getting stressed, tired all the time. I mean, there's a lot in, you know, there's buying a lottery, sleep in it, you earn money in it, done. It's <laughs> better. On the way back, we'll get on the phone, order a mattress. Yeah. Unfortunately, I think it's well we're in the job, but, oh, I don't know, eh? eBay sell. How much? It's fast quick. I look at these trucks and I envision our lorry going past. Oh. You're envisioning it going past for like two seconds. I'm envisioning it having it for like days and days and days and then. I might get to hate it one day. Might be. We'll see. You better get comfy though, baby. You're going to Scotland. I'll get so comfy in it. I'll have my iPad as a TV. 
I will have my night heater, I'll have my fridges in, I'll have my food ready, I'll have my slippers ready, my flip flops. <laughs> We've got to do a tackle celebration in July. I want to get going with it now. I want to get the truck back to the yard. I want to get you in it. I want to get you hooked up to the trailer and go. But how good is it now? I we haven't got something that's financed. So we haven't got a. We haven't got a, we haven't, If the truck is parked up, right, what we're going to do is we're going to pay the insurance off. We're going to pay the tax straight away. If that truck is parked up, open the hindrances. I'll bring 40 litres in the can when we, to fill it up, put some in my thingy. That'll put you a little bit. And then we'll go straight away and find a fuel. Let's get the bill going. Mm. Oh, no. oh. Mickle, that is the one we followed on the way up here. Do you remember? Oh, yeah. And I said, oh my god, you should get one of them. It was a Scania, is this a Scania? Maybe you literally picked something up and now it's on the way back. Quite possibly. And in that time, I managed to buy a whole lorry. Well, half a lorry. Because with a trailer, it looks massive. Huh? That's what I'm saying. <laughs> we just got a lorry. We just bought a big lorry. We just bought a lorry. We just bought nine and a half tons worth of metal. That is our <laughs> problem now. Well, that's just metal. Plastic and leather and
whole new job. For now, we will have the gas struts. Yeah. Uh, I'll use them, and uh, I'm going to go back to the customer and have the crack about the other bits and pieces, mate. And uh, I'll, I'll come back to you. So just get the gas struts for now, mate, and then we'll. we'll yeah. Okay. These, these go for yourself, are they? Yes, mate. Yeah. On, on yeah. my account. Yeah. Please, mate. Yeah. Lovely. Thanks, Dan. Am I the customer? Call ended. Yeah. And the customer. <laughs> no, thank you. I would not like a steering wheel. Thank you very much. I'm just going to get a ten pound cover on it. Yeah, it might be a scrap yard, yeah. I don't care if it's uh, too bulky or whatever. And mattress, surely we can get it some cheap. Yeah, eBay. Yeah. Mm. I'm sure. You, did you look on eBay? It's like 80 quid. Yeah, they're like yeah. 80 quid. <laughs> oh, three, four. No. Yeah. So the customer says thank you, but no thank you. Yeah, but the customer's always right, so. <laughs> okay. Brian speaking. Hello, Brian. Mick. Hello, mate. How are you? Yeah, all good, mate. Mate, yesterday you sorted me out some 33 mil long wheel, uh, long reach wheel nut tags. Could I please have another 100? Well, you're lucky because I've got 100 on my shelf. Ah, some results. Maybe at Monday, mate. If I said to you uh, I want a jaw kit for a fifth wheel, what information do you need? Type of fifth wheel. Now, you've got a make, which is either Joss, uh, oh god, I can't think of the other one. Fontaine. Now, but anyway, yeah. But yeah, Fontaine, a little different make. Yeah. There should be a plate on them which gives you the type. Now, on a Joss one, it'll probably be something like a JSK and then a number and then a letter like JSK 36 DB which is your box standard fifth wheel and the only difference is height of the feet that you get on it right now if it's got a little plate inserts in there like those little nylon things those anti-split things teflon plates rather yeah uh, again it'll have uh, a number on there but it may be a different jaw kit I have no idea until I check it out Montaigne fifth wheel could be a 150 SP or something like that. Um, but usually there's some, unless you're unlucky, the plate is usually riveted to the edge or there's numbers stamped in it. Okay, well, mate, I'll have a look. Thanks, mate. Do you want to drive? You're happy not driving? I'm happy. Thanks, that steering wheel is, mate. With no buttons in it as well. 400 something. Plus that, that is. Yeah. Then the mattress. So the one I've seen, ones of eBay, they've got measurements. So we'll wait till we get the truck, we'll measure it and make sure they're the right one. Well, why don't you just go on the Volvo, um, whatever, he quoted you 400 quid, 300 quid for it. Yeah. On the website, sure to God, um, they will have measurements of the mattress. No? Maybe. I don't know. The one off Volvo has is, is got springs, right? And that's why they go a bit shitty. But the one off eBay said it was memory foam, which would be a whole lot better. <laughs> I don't know what's worse, the mattress or the steering wheel. Yeah. I mean, honestly, just because it's got all the brand on it, they think they can make lots yeah. of money. Oh my God, we actually bought a lorry. I might be saying that a few times, yeah. Whilst it's sinking in. Oh my God, we actually bought a lorry. Upon checking, I can see that the payment has cleared successfully. Here are the transaction details. Payment to G and E commercials, payment details, bank account, payment clearance date 28th of yeah, 104. 104 in the afternoon is when we bought our lorry on the 28th of January. Balance supply success, original amount, loads of money, authorized amount, loads of money, cleared amount, loads of money. Should you need any further assistance? Assistance, feel free to reach out again. I'll be more than happy to see you. Oh, well, just stand up. Okay, thank you. Oh, okay, thank you. Have a wonderful weekend. Nice. <laughs> it's a swell body. <laughs> For real, real life. Did I see coming? Yes. Did I believe? 
believe it'll happen, sort of. Can I believe it happened? Not yet. <laughs> I want it to start rolling now. I'm gonna drive it on Wednesday. I'm gonna drive it next time. Real drive it. Okay, I'm not gonna earn money on it yet. But I'm gonna drive it next week. I've got a new set of relays in it because the K5 relay, which is the gearbox pro for going. It's got bound to be relays in it. I've got them in the band. Oh, nice. And I might have to give up the gym. Start the weekend, yeah. Will, Will I have time on the weekend? Will I have the energy on the weekend? I don't know, I guess. Lizzie says, oh my god, is this yours? And we almost bought the red one, which I'm glad we didn't. Yeah, I've got the new bullet. She says, fab, well done mate, I hope it serves you well. Um, emoji with uh, star signs on him. No. Emoji with uh, glasses on him. No, no, no. Emoji with... Um, no, no, no emoji. Just please. one. It was a very smiley, but not too smiley. No, no, no. A little smile, a really. No, no emoji, Leanna, no. A kiss, just one kiss. I don't want an emoji, just send a bloody thing. <laughs> <laughs> so exciting, so exciting. Oh, um, Jesus. <laughs> Can't believe not even one emoji. It's so cool. Don't forget, it's going to be from me. Yes, there's going to be thousands of emojis. Oh my god, we've got a truck. <laughs> no one tells you what to do, Dad. <laughs> well, it was a very successful day. A very successful week, a very successful year. Let's hope this year is uh, just as successful. Let's hope next January we're buying another one. <laughs> With Soon the money that. that we've earned from this one. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Oh yeah, the middle cupboard never works. No, it's, 
Because in that yellow one, it did though. Oh, did it? I probably see it could get one covered with like yeah. a dingy lid. I mean, if you rip the lid off, it could be just a, a shell. Tray. Yeah. yeah. Like if I go over a bump, I don't want it bumping. Yeah. Your seat is definitely heated. Yeah? So, you know, you've got a heated seat. Nice, I did not know that. But it would never really go cold, will it, with you in it? Nighttime, the, the oh, nighties have got full whack and the daytime heat. Now. Yeah, I 
I don't know the right. Well, in the middle when I get my license. <laughs> You're an owner. That's a that's a that's a minor detail. Yeah, owner operator. Not operator, yeah, owner. Oh, just an anyway, owner. it's being pedantic. Isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Right. Come on now. You're an owner operator. I'm an owner operator. As soon as I get that license, so it's just just a glitch in the dark. Your owner and I'm operator. <laughs> We're like that. Owning, operating. Who'd have thought today would be the day? Well guys, this is it. That's the end of our exciting day today. We have bought a truck. We have celebrated in the pub. Uh, we are very excited. We're looking forward to driving it. We're looking forward to driving it back home and then earning some money on it eventually. Uh, wish us luck. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this very exciting day with us. Did you enjoy it? I did. We enjoyed it tremendously. We enjoyed it tremendously. We're a little bit tired and drained now because too much excitement. Uh, please subscribe, hit the bell button so you get a notification every time I post a video. Hopefully I will post some for you very soon. Driving it to the, 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 the what do you call it? Mm. The port. The yard. Driving it to the, to the port to pick up a load of some sort, trailers and whatever else we're gonna need. Stay with me, go on that journey with me, and yes, one step at a time, we'll get there. See you next time, thank you ever so much for watching. Bye.